LC Crickets, what is up? It's Chris Wormley here, defensive lineman for the Baltimore Ravens, number 93. I heard you guys had a killer season this year and finished second in the league. I want to congratulate Jackson, Dump Truck, Joshua, True, Tough, and Bulldog. I'll see you guys. Keep up the hard work. Go get that first place uh, in your league next year. Keep working in the offseason. Take care, everyone. Good luck. Hey, Solomon. Taylor Rapp here from the LA Rams. I checked out your highlight video. Man, you're a monster wrecking havoc out there. LC Crickets. What's up, baby? It's Arthur Motes, number 55 out of Pittsburgh. Steelers. And first off, I got to give y'all a big time shout out for finishing second in the league, man. I know y'all wanted to win it all. It didn't work out this way, but man, y'all did y'all thing. So definitely wanted to give y'all a major shout out for that, all right? Now, I will say this, upcoming season. Make sure y'all put that work in this time, right? Make sure you put that work in this offseason so when it comes around next time, we don't finish second. We will be the champions, all right? So enjoy yourselves. Enjoy the banquet. And before I go, I need all of y'all to remember this one day. Here we go, Steelers. Here we go. Ah! They want me to describe this group of kids in three words, almost impossible. But if I was going to do it, I would start out with heart. Well, the first thing I'd like to say is you all were very, very coachable of a football team. Probably the most coachable kids that I've ever been around in my life. And that's saying something. Aggressive. They have integrity. Focused. Strong. Determination. If you told them they can't, they would do it twice as good. That's what we love about this team. They gave you their all every play. Very goal-oriented team. We set goals for you kids each week and you all met each goal. And that shows y'all's willingness and toughness to play for each other and for your coaches. They had perseverance. And family. And ruthless. Hard workers. We had record breakers this year. We had Mr. Carter. He throwed six touchdowns, which has not been accomplished at LCYFO as a cricket. And we had Jay Money, Mr. Hampton. Everybody seen him run up and down the field all year long. He finished regular season with 45 touchdowns. That has not been done. That is something for these two young men to hold on to until the next great group comes through. One man I can point out would be Aubrey Williams, the most unselfish player on the team. Proud of that young man, hardest hitter on the team, unselfish. The one time I can remember of Aubrey was coming back to the huddle saying, Coach, I don't care if I run the ball, I just want to hit. That's what it takes in teamwork. Proud of that young man. Selfless football team. You all didn't care who scored the touchdowns, who blocked, who made the, the best blocks, who made the best tackles. It didn't matter. It was like, it was like each of you were scoring every time or each, every one of you were making the block, or every one of you was tackling. We went from playing Rocky Top at the first of the season, getting killed, going to Grace without a center, with Bulldog going in and being center, 53 pounds, to Jackson Williams stepping up, being the most instrumental player on the team this year by handling the ball every single play. But all in all, in this group of kids, they hit hard, they run fast, and they learned a lot. From day one to the last day of the season, when we played the mod squad, I seen a lot come through from these kids, all the way down to Tanner and True. Tanner always had a smile on his face, recovered the fumbles in the Rocky Top games up there, mud dripping off his helmet, smiling ear to ear. That's what football's about, guys. I'm very, very proud to have coached each and every one of you very proud of you for the young men you are and the young men that you are going to become 
and the football players that you all are. I had a blast this year, and the three words I can only say is bad team. cheerleaders. Congrats on your first place finish, Go Panthers! Congrats, Crickets, we're so proud of you. <laughs> hey guys, my name is Destiny Stahl and I'm an ETSU cheerleader. I was a former LCYFO cheerleader and I just wanted to congratulate the LC Crickets on their first place win. Congratulations, girls. Thank you, Cricket cheerleaders, for your support. Thank you to all the cheerleaders that Cheered me on and supported. Thank you for cheering us on this season. We could have done it without you. Thank you for cheering us on. Thank you, Chillers. Hey, Chillers. Thank you for um, cheering for us this year. Thank you, cheerleaders, for cheering us on this season. Thank you for, for cheering. Me. Thank you for cheering us on, cheerleaders, in the um, LC game. Go Panthers. <laughs>
five, six, seven, eight. Hit them at the bottom. And your first place crickets, Lenore Seymour. Yeah.